Hey, Afro Sean here. <laughs> hey, PT Sean here, and I got a quick question for you. Are people too sensitive nowadays? Do I bring it back to the last video, my boy? High media over here. Words matter because the weight behind them. Because at the break it down, words are words, but it's not what about what the word means and what it is about. It's the power behind that word. Let's just say, for example, the word white. Just a color, just all that. It's just describing something. But you look at the deep roots from it. White people, vanilla, beige. Some people would think it real bad. So that word have different meanings from different people, different situations, different, different uh, backgrounds. The uh, meaning, the history, and the culture behind that word, what's matter. It's not the word itself. It's what's, what power you be bringing into the word. And don't get me started on black. Or the N word. Are people too uh, sensitive about the word? I mean, do we uh, take too much offense of it? It's all depending who you ask. I mean, you ask me, I think some yes and some no. The people who not thinking about it enough or the people who are too extreme about it. It's very few people who like it. in the middle, you know. And I'm mostly in the middle. I, don't, I lean to that, I lean back, I lean back and forth, but like, there are a lot of people out there like just look around just to get offended. It's not healthy, I don't know. Why would you want to get offended? And why are you looking for it? I don't, know. I don't know. I don't know. I believe cancer culture is a little bit to the extreme side. Like I said in that video, person probably didn't have malicious intent behind the word. But like, it is like a couple of situations that should like, oh yeah, you shouldn't do that. It's not just being sensitive, it's just saying, what are you doing? You're offending me, bro. Like, bring back to the N word. Don't, don't say that. You're not part of that community. I don't care who gave you the permission to say it. And once you say it, when you're not around that person or he around other people, you won't have a problem with it. I have a problem with it. It doesn't really affect me unless they have malicious intent to it. They put a hard R on it or something like that. But like, oh no, I just think if somebody tend to offend, tend to to hurt or bring down a, like a community or like person, that's when you should get offended. It's not being oversensitive or nothing. It's not being like, whoa, it's not being political correct. It just kind of courtesy at the end of the story. Like, what are you doing? But I don't, I don't really have a strong opinion about this. All I know is people can take it too far, but there's all the people who take it too little. And at the end of the story, just for me, is somebody don't have like bad attempts behind the offensive comment. You gotta teach them, you gotta like educate. Yeah, you gotta educate person like why is it wrong, why you shouldn't be saying it. But if they do, or if they are doing the same thing, then like, I can't help you. But I got a quick question for you, Evan. Are America? Is this world is too sensitive right now? I don't know. What do you what do you think? Well, I'm about to head back, start right back of my marathon of Dragon Ball stuff. Still working on the videos. Been delayed like two times like a video game. But see ya. I'm not doing that. I'm just gonna, you know, just try to. Or no, or is it like. You're not trying to close, are you? Wow.